Chicago County, folks. Happy New Year, everyone. Uh, this is a piece I've been working on called Wonders Never Cease, and uh, it's about a particularly eventful week in my life. Even in these times of hate and fear, when the bridges of freedom seem to crumble as the walls of suffering rise at the edges, there will be moments. There will still be moments. There will still be little jubilations. There will be joys that feel like miracles if you squint. Don't let the bastards take them from you. Amen. Set a safe keep in your heart where the bigots and the profiteers can't touch you, where the killers and the businessmen can't burn them down. Even in the midst of an apocalypse, you will still be living day to day as well, and there will still be wonders to behold. And the cowards and the preachers and the hate mongers, they will try to take these things from you too, as they try to take the world, as they want to worry you blind. They want to absorb you in the tumult so they can break you utterly, so you're too joyless to properly fight back. But set a safe keep in your heart for the little things that are still wonderful, for the intersections that are still amazing, even as we stumble into war. Even as we tumble toward the darkness, there are lights that will fuel you further. This is the trail of breadcrumbs you can follow back when we have won. If you let the worry kill the little joys, the bastards and the fascists will have won twice. You cannot let them do this. Set a safe keep. Still find happiness where it can bloom. I talked to my shut-in uncle Wednesday for about an hour with my grandmother. His mental illness made it so he hadn't spoken more than half a sentence at a time to another human being in 30 years. But Wednesday, I sat around a Christmas tree with my uncle and my grandmother, and we caught him up on everything I am now, and we taught him little stories about the past. And that orange Nazi goblin in his castle cannot take that away from me. I have that moment in this sea of troubles to warm me in the safe keep of my heart. Don't let them take those little moments. Don't let the bastards beat you twice. And a little by and by, we will take them. We will take back even their fraudulent victory. And we will, if you can hold on to the safe keep in your heart. Saturday, my little brother called. He just eloped. He just got married with his lady in a chapel by the sea in Northern California. He called us up on New Year's Eve to tell us the good news. My little baby brother's a married man now by the beach, by the beach in Monterey. And all the trumped up fascists in the world cannot take that away. Even as the existential horrors bloom, little flowers of doom, they stretch out for the sun and blossom. Here's hoping that our miracles will grow in equal or greater measure. Even in the deepest depths, will wonders never cease? Do wonders ever cease? No, wonders never cease. Wonders never cease. Thank you. Thank you, Mike. Kate.